Good morning, everyone. This is John Myers, the head golf professional here at Kramer Mountain Club. Today we're on our first hole, a wonderful par five. That first will tempt you off the tee, everyone. First thing I want to talk about before we discuss the approach shot is your tee shot on number one at Kramer Mountain Club. Okay, it is not required that you hit driver, okay? It's going to tempt you. There's a fairway bunker on the right-hand side. Please use your touchscreen caddy to find the distance from your appropriate tee to that fairway bunker and then take the club that will keep you just short of the fairway bunker. Okay, this is a true three shot par five. All right, so your first shot, you wanna be safe. You do not wanna bring the bunker into play. All right, so that may be driver for some, that may be three wood for some, might be hybrid, and for the long hitters, that might even be an iron. So again, play smart on the first hole. Where we're standing right now is where the architect, Dan Maples, wanted you to approach the green from. This is where he's given us the most room for what we would call the landing area on the par five. Okay, so here I am roughly about 90 yards away from the hole. I've hit a really good shot. This is where now I'm going to be playing my wedge. This is a slightly uphill shot. Factor that into your yardage. Again, at the club, we'll use a red flag for the front, white for the middle, blue for the back. I can see here today that we're on the front third of the green. It's a red flag, okay? So again, I wanna make sure I can take a club where I can carry the front edge with a slightly elevated green. If your ball hits short, it's gonna spin and roll off. All right, so I wanna make sure I take plenty of club for this shot. Now again, I'm picking my line Standing behind the ball, coming in, looking at my target, getting, getting nice and set up. All right, now we're putting for birdie. Time for the next hole.